Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be showing you how we make our raw meals for our pit bulls. Okay, so starting off, we have some ground beef. This is going to be most of the bowl or 80% of the bowl. Next, we'll be moving on to some chicken backs, 10% of the bowl. This will also be part of the 10%. This is dehydrated duck heads and duck wings. And here we have some beef liver. That'll be 5% of the bowl. Here we have some green lip mussels. We give these twice a week along with fish. Here we have some beef kidney. This is 5% of the bowl or the organ meat. Here is some turkey gizzards. That's also 80% of the bowl, mussel meat. Here we have some quail eggs. We give those twice a week. And here is a supplement that we use, bee pollen. And here's everything set up. All right, so starting off, I'll be making Pablo's bowl. He's going to be eating about four pounds for some weight gain. I'm starting off by putting the mussel meat in the bowl, and that consists of ground beef and some turkey gizzards. All right, next, I'll be moving on to the bone portion of the bowl. I will be adding two chicken backs. Right, and then the smallest portion of the bowl, I'll be adding the organ meat, the beef kidney, and I'll also be adding the beef liver. This should only be about 5%. Right, next I'll be adding some green lip mussels. These are good for joint health and a good anti-inflammatory to give to large breed dogs. And then I'll add some quail eggs for some calcium and protein. And then I'll add some bee pollen as a natural antihistamine. And here is the finished result of Pablo's bowl. And here he is enjoying it. As I said before, we are feeding Pablo about four pounds of food. He is 110 pounds. He just had a breeding, so we're going to be putting some weight back on him. Next, we will be moving on to making Audemars bowl. Audemars is about the same weight as Pablo. He is about 105 to 110 pounds. So he will be eating about the same, probably around three and a half to four pounds of food. Starting off, we're going to put in the muscle meat, 80% ground beef. He is allergic to certain poultry like turkey and chicken. So he will be getting the um, dehydrated duck products. Right now I'm adding the green lip mussels, as I said before, for joint health. I also added some beef kidney and some beef liver for the organ meat portion. And right now this is the bone portion of the bowl and we're going to be giving him three duck heads. And then I'm also going to be adding some quail eggs to his bowl as well for some calcium and some protein and for some skin and eye health benefits and here's the finished product for Audemars bowl about three and a half to four pounds as you can see here on our scale just to do a double check and here's a picture of the beautiful bowl again before he eats as i said before Audemars is about 105 to 110 pounds he is the son of XDP, XXL, Designer Pitbulls, Prog, Prog's Problem, Black Panther Pitbull. He will be having his first reading coming up with Melkushla pretty soon. And here he is enjoying his nice bowl. He is 100% raw fed. If you guys are interested in adding some healthy options to your dog's bowl, um, it's okay if you can't feed 100% raw, we totally understand. So here we have some kibble booster ideas. So here are some good kibble boosters to add to your puppy's bowl. I have some 4Health kibble in a bowl, and then I'm going to be adding some uh, freeze-dried beef liver from Holy. We have this on our website. It's a protein pack or a beef liver powder. It adds flavor and some additional vitamins to your pup's bowl. So if they're picky, I just add a little bit of the powder, add some water to hydrate. And then I'm also going to be adding a little bit of muscle meat as well. We don't want to overdo it, like I said, because this is just a puppy. So we're going to add this and then we're going to add some green lip muscles for some joint health as well. Once you chop everything up, 
you're going to grab a spoon and mix everything together because sometimes puppies can be funny and pick all of the raw meat out of the bowl and leave the kibble. All right, and here's our pup eating her boosted bowl. She is a Pablo and Dream daughter. If you guys have picky pups or you just want to add some flavor or some healthier options to your dog's bowl, go ahead and add a little bit of raw meat or the beef liver powder that I suggested and let us know what your dogs think of the meal suggestions in the comments.